Hello friends, Tony here. So in the previous video, I showed you how to set up this filament starter project. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to customize little bit. So we have here, we are in the post collection. Also we have users and I had comments how to add uh, the admin table instead of the users. And that is okay, you just need to create a resource. If you don't know filament, you can watch my full course on filament, you need to create an admin resource and display there the admin table. Also, you need to have the admin uh, model in migrations. Okay. Now let's go to post and here, what I want is, uh, for example, as you can see on the table, we have the title, image, author, and published. The image is empty for everyone. And also the published is uh, an icon but I want to change that to be a toggle so we can change the published directly on the table. We don't need to go to edit and change there. Also on the front end, if I open, I think, yeah, here we have the front end. As you can see, we have the logo, the link here, which is on blue. Also here is the background on blue. We have home, all well, that is post. And when we hover over the posts, the title is going to change to blue and you can change that so for example if i open my let's open the tidewind.config.js and as you can see on the colors the we have primary here and colors is blue if i change this so let's make a yellow the primary one i'm going to save and also we need to run the yarn yarn dev as you can see i have done that and if you have done that, as you can see now has changed the, the filament starter to be yellow. Also the button here is going to change the yellow background and here the yellow. And if I hover over the post, the title changed from blue to yellow. Okay. We don't have any image as you can see, all are empty. So let's come here and go to the edit of this one. Wait, I go to edit. I'm going to change the title also to be uh, my first post. Okay, I'm going to change the publish today to be today. And I'm going to add the media, browse, and I'm going to change, I'm going to choose this one, open. And I'm going to say here, add files and insert here okay now we have that one and let's go here save the changes okay saved as you can see go back to post and i'm going to change also this one now as you can see on the image we have the image for this post i'm going to change also this one and move the published that today is going to be the published date is going to be today we just say here my second post for this one. I'm going to add also here a media. So we can choose this one or we can browse here. Also, let me just show you one more thing. So let's go to media library. And here we can say new media or we can upload multiple ones. So I'm going to choose file and we can choose two of them as you can see it's going to upload i'm going to say submit and now we have three of them and let's go to post and let's edit this so change the title from this one to my uh, second post the Publish date is going to be today. Add media. And I'm going to choose now from here. This one I'm going to say insert. And let's scroll down and say save changes. Good. Scroll up and let's go to post. And you can see here we have the, my first post and my second post and has the image. And of course, if I go to front end and the refresh here, yeah, we have my first and my second post. Good. But oh, as I told you, I want 
here the change this from the icon to be a toggle so we can switch from published to unpublished indirectly in the table so i'm going to open for that the vs code and here let's close this and let's open the post resource on the table okay here we have the the public static function table we have the title text column for title uh, an image username which is a relationship and we have icon column is published now instead of icon column i'm going to change that to the sorry toggle column and we don't need to be a boolean here label is going to be published and it's going to be sortable if you want and if i save that come here as you can see now we have uh, toggled and because right now we have my first post and my second post published which means we see also the my first post and my second post let's go to admin and i'm going to change also you can see the count here is going to change from the admin so my second post i'm going to make from my uh, published to unpublished now published post 17 and draft 5 and if i go to front end and refresh here yeah we have only my first post okay so if you click here we have the title posted by admin 12 hours ago here is not going to show the feature image is going to show only when we list the post yeah so you can fix that so for example if i close this and let's open here the resources views and we have the live wire here we have the home or which is this one okay so you need to go to routes web route and here we have route get home and we have this home uh, live wire component okay class home extent component and what this is going to return the view livewire.home and add the post there so livewire.home this one here we have the latest post on the head two as we can see here so if i change for example the text color to be yellow and let's say 500 and if i save as we can see now we have yellow here we have a grid so for each post here and if the post has the image it's going to display the image okay source post image url otherwise it's going to else it's going to display this div with flex item center text gray so we can say also here text uh, primary and if i save that we have text primary here article okay also you can change the logo here so let me just open and we can go to components we have layouts if i open the app layout you can see we have the body here and we have this x sections header so if i go to sections header here we have the x container which is also this one uh component we have this container here but what i want to show you is this one x logo okay so we have this x that logo which is right here and we can change that for example from filament starter to code with tony and if i save come here we have now code with tony here as you can see okay and you can change um, anything you want if you know filament now if you don't know you can watch my full tutorial on filament you can find that on my uh, youtube channel that's it all about this video i just wanted to show you you can make some uh, customization and some changes if you want on this project now don't forget if you like such a videos subscribe to my channel like the video share with your friends and see you in the next one all the best thank you very much